I'm Walter Isaacson, the author of The Innovators, and I want to talk about the important role that video games played in the digital revolution. It began back at MIT in the 1940s with the Tech Model Railway Club, a group of geeks and hackers who built really wonderful model railways, but they also were deeply into computers. And they get a computer at some point with a video display monitor, and they realize how important it is for somebody to be intimate with a computer, to be able to be hands-on. So Steve Russell and some of the other people at MIT back then invented a game called Space War. And on the monitor of that computer, you could sort of navigate a little bit of a blip. You even had a gravitational field in the sun. And you could play a game in which you tried to you know, win a battle in space. That was the first popular video game. And it was shipped with a lot of the deck computers. At one point, a guy named Nolan Bushnell, who had studied at the University of Utah, which had a really great graphics program. He became addicted to space war. He told me, you know, Steve Russell, the guy who invented space war, was like a god to me. He'd kind of squandered a lot of his money uh, gambling, and it, you know, didn't work out so well. So he had to work weekends at night at a uh, sort of an amusement park in the video arcade. And he looked at how people were putting their quarters into pinball machines. So out in California, he starts a company called Atari. And then he invents something called Pong. So simple, it just says, you know, hit ball for high scores. And so you see that notion of simplicity, that notion of hands-on interaction with the computer. At one point, uh, sort of a young dropout from college named Steve Jobs comes to the lobby of Atari and says, you got to give me a job. Eventually, they do. He and his friend from down the street, Steve Wozniak, they geek out on all the video games. They make a new version of Pong that's a single player version called Breakout. So I love seeing, as a video game uh, you know, fan, I love seeing how the invention of video games intertwines to help inform the invention of the personal computer.